This week's Milton Minute is brought to you by the Milton Times. Our two surly old buildings on the north side of town, the former Hendry's ice cream plant and the former Swift hat shop, saw significant movement this past week, though not necessarily in a forward direction. The Red Swift building may have one more shot at being preserved, as a recently discovered document from 1918 has brought into question who has jurisdiction over the parcel of town land on which the crumbling structure could possibly be moved. And on the Hendry's site, selectmen have asked for help from Senator Brian Joyce in expediting the sale process of the town-owned portion of the condemned building. The town hopes to move the building into private hands as soon as possible. Also this past week, four new police officers were sworn in after completing six months of intense training at the Boston Police Academy. Officers Patrick Knee, Ryan O'Rourke, Travis Weeks, and John Larson were the first Milton police officers to take part in the training program, which sees one-third of its enrollees drop out before completion. Details on these stories and all the other news from around town is in this week's issue of the Milton Times on newsstands every Thursday, or visit us online at miltontimes.com. Thank <laughs> you.